More than 3,000 strong on the Facebook page praying for the Meltons. Jack and Noah Melton still hospitalized after suffering complications from E. coli 0157 that turned into hemolytic uremic syndrome. The page started by Alan Duty and his wife. Uh, Greg and Alyssa have been members of our church for uh, a couple of years now and um, so we love and care for them very, very deeply. The number one goal of the page to stir up prayers for the two young boys. The Meltons have been clear from the very beginning that uh, God has been their rock and their strength in the midst of a very difficult trial and a time of, of trouble. They're also taking financial donations to help assist the family with medical costs. We're sending all the donations to them directly. Allen says he's talked to the family who is overwhelmed with all the support. The, the Meltons just want to express that they're very grateful uh, for everyone that's praying for them. Allen believes with all the prayers, the Meltons will get through these difficult days. They talk about trust in God, you know, in a daily sense, uh, but this is an opportunity for them to really show that they do. With faith in God, the Melton's young boys will recover quickly and without future complications.